If you want to export your Netflix queue, here's how to do it in just a few steps. First, pull up your queue and then highlight from your first movie down to the end of your list. And again, you're going to get all these columns. Don't worry about that. Just bring it all the way down. And then you're going to control C or edit copy, however you like to copy your information. Then you're going to pull up Notepad or some other text editor and control V or edit paste in all of the information because that strips out all of the formatting from the Netflix page. Next, you're going to do control A or edit select all to select all the new text from your notepad and then you're going to control C or edit copy from your notepad and then next you're going to pull up a spreadsheet so I'm just going to pull up Excel put your cursor up in the home position A1 and then you're going to paste or again control V so we're going to paste the information in there and by doing this you'll notice that the spreadsheet will use the space between those different columns and actually create columns in your spreadsheet so I just want my titles of my movies so I'm going to cut out column A and B which contains uh, the ratings whether or not it's a DVD and what genre it is so I'm just going to delete those columns and I'm going to delete the last five columns as well because I don't care about those so I'm going to delete those next you're going to push F5 on your keyboard or under find and select you're going to click go to that's what the shortcut to get to go to is F5 then we're going to click special and we're going to tell the spreadsheet that we want it to select all blanks and it does that for you as you can see all my blanks are selected and then next I'm going to hit control plus minus or you can just go over here to delete and and I did delete on the toolbar and by doing that it gets rid of all of your blank lines in your queue and now you have an easy to read and printable queue or you can import it into some other program